tonight on Twisted Gypsy Spook Show. We join the guys back out at Octagon Hall on their search for the ghost of the Rebel Dead. And this time, the guys get a ghostly helping hand from the other side. The Spook Show takes you back into the shadows for part two, The Ghost of Octagon Hall. Here. So we do it in it's a secret uh, room in a haunted location. <sighs> Up all night, sleep all day. This was actually the nursery here at Octagon Hall, mm -hmm. which was only accessible through a staircase that was in the master bedroom. Uh, this room didn't actually get a door till the was it the early 1900s, Jerry? Early 1900s, 1920s. 1923 or so. So. Um, this was the nursery. Oh, we're sleeping. We're racking out here. Gypsy style. Say something here, Jerry. Ghost man, Sean B, you can see by my eyes, we've been up all night and um, we're up here at the, uh, the little girls room anyway. We're gonna get some sleep and uh, hit it back tonight. So, here we go. Good night. Stairs, the light has came on by itself. Look up there. Can you see the light on? Kind of see it? Yep, you can kind of see the light turn on. It's been turning on and off by itself all day. I believe it's upstairs in the hospital room. Let's go look, Big Rig. You guys see, we got Big Rig's got his recorder going here. We got all these cool things going on. Is anybody here that'd like to speak with us? If you are here and you're a Confederate soldier, what's your name and rank, soldier? Now it's all quiet up here. But the light didn't turn itself on yet. This is the attic where we had an old Confederate soldier who was wounded at battle. Came into the Caldwell family home asking for help. He was treated in here in the hospital room right next door to us. When the Union soldiers came in to storm the place, they snuck him up here in the attic. Now, the story goes, he took his shoe off, which was where he was shot. He took his shoe off, he ended up bleeding out into the attic, and that's where he perished and died. <laughs> Kalashi, go ahead. <laughs> 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 so check it out. See what we find. And the activity is starting to ramp up. 
Um, you definitely can feel it when you walk into the house. Right on. And you can feel it changing as the evening goes on. Yes. So uh, I'm anticipating a lot of action. Anticipating! And I'm anticipating a lot of uh, good quality EVPs and hopefully some shadows or maybe even full body apparitions. Yeah! We're going to get you, brother. We're going to love it up. Come on. Over here is where they've been... Are you really, Sean? Yep. What's, what's going on? He's getting, he's seeing shadows. Gone Hall, out to the Slave Cemetery, see if we can't get something. We're heading back to the Slave Cemetery. And off here to the right, there's a couple Confederate soldiers buried. They died out here at the hall. It's, it's ugly out here. Uh, it's uh, February 10th, almost the 11th, 2012. We're outside of Octagon Hall out here at the Slave Cemetery. Um, this is my last recording. It's uh, <laughs> it's crazy. I mean, this is what we're seeing. Jerry didn't have his light on, it'd be complete darkness out here. So Now they know that this is a slave cemetery by the rocks that mark the graves and the type of trees that are planted out here. Yeah. So Slaves didn't get big fancy stones like these guys. They got rocks, so they didn't have money to afford all that stuff. Bald cypress, one of the trees that they planted to mark a grave. Oops, I'm sorry. Like I said, you can see these stones here and the rocks. There's an actual grave marker there. Okay, we're recording out here at the cemetery, slave cemetery. Hopefully I can talk to the guy me and Jerry got to last time. There's no mosquitoes tonight. Is there anyone out here that would like to speak with us? This is Sean, Jerry, and I'm Brent. What up? Well, we just came back up from the slave cemetery. <clears throat> We're going to have to review our evidence, our EVP session, see if we got anything or not. Stay tuned, though. We'll let you know. Okay, I'm going to start the music for you guys. I hope you enjoy it. We know that you guys are here, and we are here to talk to you, to acknowledge you, to listen. So talk to us, please. Move around. Did you hear that? Yeah. Hold on a second. Did you hear that? Yeah. Hold on a second. Just went off. Got a cold spot. It's going in. This is Caldwell. Is that you, ma'am? Mr. Caldwell, sir. Can I speak with you a moment? Something just fly. Look at that. Look at that. I saw that. I saw that. You see that? It, it, came, it was at my camera. It was at my, it was at my camera. Stop. I gotta stop. Hey guys, this is the Ghost Band Sean B. We're here with the Twisted Gypsies. Gypsies. Your pals and mine. We are in the basement at the Octagon Hall. Right behind me, guys, is the stairwell in this room. You can't see it. We'll open the door up later. But it's underneath the stairwell of the house where they hid Confederate soldiers from Union troops. Yeah, yeah. And it's rumored that those soldiers still walk through here. There's a couple balls that people laid out, too, because... A little girl burnt to death down here, and that's, this little girl's name is believed to be, or they say it is, Mary Elizabeth. So, talk to us so we're down here trying to... Uh, so we got a ball, and we set it out, and they said the ball's going to move around and stuff. So we're going to see, because we're going to sit here until we get it right all night.
Can you say hello? Hello. Hello. All right. Are you a little girl? Are you a woman? You have to speak clearly. You're a lady? Yeah. Okay. How old are you? Did you say you're from Tennessee? Nashville. 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 Are you from Tennessee? No. <laughs> no. Where are you from? Say Texas, man. Huh? You support the Confederacy? Enough color. Why? It's twice the same guy, twice right there. John, where are you right now? And we're staying here, we'd like to know who we're staying with, that's all. <laughs> Something to grab you? Yeah, right there on the back of my leg. Are you serious? Yes. I swear to God, everything. I'm a kid. All I need to see is the look on your face to know you told me. Oh, I'm sure to God, man. <laughs> Get a shot of his face. I didn't know. You didn't touch me, swear to God. Twain just got touched. No, no. Uh, uh, your pocket, hands in pockets and everything, man. Face. He's no, I got it. I got it all on tape. He just got touched by something down here in the basement oh, here at Octagon Hall. And, uh, yeah, look at his goosebumps, man. He's, <laughs> he's feeling it. Sasquatch. He's, got, he's, he's, he's feeling it, man. Look, right there's the steps. Reportedly, this is the area that the little girl is, likes yeah. to hang out. Where's that? Was that ball? The there? ball is right there. It's, I've been watching it. The ball is still right there. Not hasn't moved. From the haunted back roads of America, this is the Twisted Gypsy Spook Show saying, "Keep your eyes on the shadows." Because you never know when the spook shows come into your town. Oh, I'm alright. Oh, I just my ass. My ass.